Hi friends. So today's wellness minutes are about swelling in your hands when you're exercising. Now we find that many women, especially when they're going for walks or they're exercising on runs, jogs in the summertime tend to get these really stiff and pudgy hands and maybe the rings get tight and they have a really hard time kind of bending their fingers. And this is actually fairly common. Now, that's not to say that if you don't have many other symptoms along with this to actually, you know, make sure that you go and get it checked out. But if it's something that's occurring when you're regularly walking or jogging or running, then here's the stats on that. First of all, it happens to about one in four people and it's twice as likely to happen to women than it does to men. And the reasons why are, well, there's a few reasons. First of all, you can be, um, your electrolyte balance can be off. So if you don't have enough minerals and enough fluid um, electrolytes manage the fluid, um, the fluid balance in and out of the cell. So if you're short on electrolytes, you come up um, by, you know, having some swelling. Um, you can also have, because of the increased pressure and exercise in the, in the body, it increases the heart rate and the blood flow, and that can pull blood away from the extremities. So sometimes you get swelling that way. And also there can be a a cool a reason for um, like to cool the body where the blood vessels dilate and they go closer to the surface of the skin and sometimes that can also cause to a swelling effect so um, how can you you know how can you make sure that that doesn't happen um, well moving your arms a lot so even though it is an extremity thing sometimes keeping your arms you know towards your heart or towards the center of your body sometimes and wiggling your fingers can can help a lot um, making sure that you're fully hydrated, um, especially if you're going to be exercising in the heat. Um, likewise, exercising in the cooler, cooler weather or inside in a cooled environment is a, um, a great way to, to handle that. Um, and also to just ensure that you have enough electrolytes, so enough fluid and enough electrolytes. So I hope this answers the mystery for a lot of people. I've been having some questions lately. And yeah, food for thought. Stay healthy, friends.